Washington, up on the Gardena bench. This is uh, a prime alfalfa seed production area. We're standing in an alfalfa seed field, and behind me is an alkali bee bed. The alkali bees are used to pollinate the uh, alfalfa plant to make seed. So we use a combination of two bees, leafcutter bees that we buy from Canada, and our native alkali bees that have been around here since uh, for a long time anyway. When we start pollinating the alfalfa seeds, usually the first week in June until the middle of July, and uh, in that time, the, our big challenge is trying to control our pests and not kill our bees. Uh, the leafcutter bees we buy from Canada, they're very expensive. Uh, if, you have to, if you kill them, you can buy more next year, but that costs you a lot of money. The alkali bees, if you kill them, you can't replace them. You just gotta hope Mother Nature keeps reproducing them and stuff. We use a combination of chemicals and we have predators. We have big-eyed bugs, damsel bugs, minute pirate bugs, assassin bugs, and they eat the baby ligus bugs too. So it's a constant taking your bug net out in the field and sweeping and counting the good bugs and the bad bugs and how far along the crop is. And as I'm counting the bad bugs, I can count the good bugs and see if they stay in balance. And with the new pesticides, you can definitely see the decrease in the bad bugs and leaving the predators. We've learned how to manage the alkali bees. We build special, special areas called alkali bee beds that are artificial alkali areas. We have underground water systems and we put like five to six ton of uh, salt on top of the ground to seal the surface and make it more conducive for the bees to dig. But alkali bees only work in an area like ours where we have limited crop rotations because they'll fly for two to three miles looking for pollen. And here we just got wheat and alfalfa seed. And so they don't, they don't fly to a co crop like corn or potatoes where people will spray an insecticide on and kill them. So that's why, why alkali bees are really good in the Walla Valley because we don't have any other crops because of our limited water supply.